to our meteorologist, Dylan Sprouse. Thanks. In other news, it's really hot. Today I saw a worm die on the street. Here's the line of heat coming in. You can see we drew it on this map for you and it ends over the coastline where it's hot here, 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 and here. I took a shower and it didn't even help. And then there's this over the water, a boat. And people are hot in the boat too. It's just hot everywhere, I guess. Wear, wear black because it's hot, hot heat. Big heat, big time. Hey guys, it's Sue Ann and Dana. And it is a really hot, let me tell you, it is hot. We are thinking about stuff that sounds real appetizing right now. And we thought of anything that's cold and easy to make. So we decided to make a beet summer salad. The best part about it is that half of the ingredients are canned and ready to go. We don't want to really have to do anything. Chives, corn, balsamic reduction, walnuts, blue cheese, arugula, beets, artichoke hearts. <laughs> Open your beets and then go drain them. And then if you bought two cans like us, Gotta open the second one. If you have corn in a can, you gotta open that too. I'll open this can of artichokes. Now that all the cans are almost open, we're almost ready to get started with the cooking process. Everything takes time. Did you get it? I think so. Doesn't look like it. I think there's a few spots that were not cut. It takes practice, but make sure you cut your can open just right so that you can get the ingredients out. Duan's gonna try one more time. Yep, I am. It's hot! It's hot in here! Finally! Sorry. So now that the main ingredients are ready, let's cut the chives. Take your chives and cut them into little coins. These are gonna go on top of your salad. You don't have to do the whole thing. Just enough. How's it smelling, Dana? It smells just like chives. Now we're ready to plate our ingredients. Arrange accordingly. If you're a vegan, you don't have to put blue cheese on your salad. But if you're not a vegan, you can put blue cheese on your salad. Make sure your hands are clean before putting your ingredients on your plate. Put the arugula on your plate. The next ingredient is the main ingredient, which is beets. Take a fork and place them on top of the arugula artfully. <coughs> Make sure when you're cooking and you pop. A lot of beets is key because it's the main ingredient because this is beet salad. Not to be confused with beef salad. The next ingredient is artichoke hearts. <clears throat> artichoke hearts. Take the artichoke hearts and try really hard not to eat them. Put them on your salad. For this part, it's preferable if your hands are clean. <clears throat> now, just sprinkle the rest of the stuff on top. Like corn. Shake it on top. Whoa. On the non-vegan salads, no blue cheese. Blue cheese on the non-vegan salads. Thank you. And then walnuts. Is it ready yet? No! Put chives on. Too air. Yeah. 
What's the last ingredient? Balsamic bread reduction. <laughs> Is that right? Just the bread reduction. Do it, Anna. Just drizzle it on. Do it to all the salads. Oh, thanks for the grub. <laughs> You're welcome. Stay cool. See you next week. Okay, go.